Hello there, you amazing viewers and subscribers, and welcome to a brand new Doctor Who unboxing video. And of course, it is an action figure review as well, because for this unboxing video, I've got an order two Doctor Who figure figure sets from Character Options is website, and they put the two together, and they both arrived. So I'm going to show you what they are. You probably know what they are from the images, but I'm sorry to say this, but I'm so looking forward to adding these into the collection, and I've been waiting a day for these, because I, I only ordered these on Monday, and they've only just came. So, thank you to Character Options for getting these to me quick as possible. I'm really looking forward to unboxing these, and show you what I think of them for this Doctor Who action figure review. So, let's dive into it. So, let's get my lucky fish knife. Cut open that side. Cut open that side and then that side and then there we go that's one box done now let's see what's in this one look good i think this might be is it the is it the one i think it is first which i'm really excited to open or is it something totally different and I'm wasting my time? Uh, I don't know. So the two figure sets I brought, these are character lot options is on a line exclusives. And I wanted to get one of these for over a year, but I didn't know if it'd be worth it. But then I was rearranging all my Doctor Who figures the other day, as you can see in my Doctor Who figure video I did. And... I lined all them all up with the doctors and then I was thinking to myself, yeah, you know what, as we're sorting them, let's just order them. So anyway, let's get into it. Oh, wow. So this one is Doctor Who, the regeneration set. <laughs> Look at that. We have the new logo back and front. We have at the bottom, the character option stuff and then on the sides. And the top part, we have Doctor Who. We don't really have the diamond shaped logo on the sides, but look how good that is. My first piece of Doctor Who merchandise with the new logo. <laughs> so let's. Oh, I hear all the figures in general. So we have the 13th Doctor in her outfit from the Power of the Doctor just after they actually get the Doctor to regenerate back from the Master. And of course, we have the 14th Doctor. So on the side, we have this awesome little biopsy of the 13th Doctor and, of course, the 14th Doctor, played by Dave Tent, who is now the second well, second actor to play another incarnation of the Doctor on screen because Tom Baker played the 4th Doctor and he came back and played a future incarnation known as the, the Creator in the 60th anniversary. So Tennant is now the second main actor to play two incarnations of the Doctor. So as you can see, we have the 14th Doctor with the buy up and here. So I'm really looking forward to giving you my actual thoughts on this figure set and what I think of it. So I'm going to put this on pause, open it, and then show you what I think of the figures myself. Oh, hang on. No, I don't need to. There we are. Hey, the box slides open. That's brilliant, actually. I'm going to keep the box in good nick. So here is the figures themselves. So take that out. We have this nice little backdrop of regeneration energy i'm really looking forward to the 60th anniversary so let's get into this so to do this i'm opening up the 13th doctor yes the 13th doctor here he is here she is sorry so we have the 13th doctor regenerated from the master basically wearing all different bits of the doctor's outfits from the past so we have Nice little detailing of the fourth Doctor scarf. So we have the fifth Doctor sticker, um, sticker salary. We have the tenth Doctor's tie. Can I get it to focus for you to see? We have the seventh Doctor's jumper. I believe these are Capaldi's tartan trousers or mainly Troutons. We have got, she is wearing Peter Capaldi's shirt. Because you can tell by the actual... Uh, talk. So hopefully this means we can actually have a regeneration in 13th Doctor wearing the 12th Doctor's outfit. She's actually wearing Matt Smith's boots in this. The head looks far better in detailing, you know, looking so much left and right, the hands. 
Uh, hands can do the 360. Same as this one, which is basically for holding the Sonic in. And to actually say, this is actually my fifth Jodie Whittaker figure I've now got in my figure collection. So, yeah. Um, she can bend the legs, but not as properly because of the material of the 7th Doctor's question mark jumper. Which is absolutely brilliant. So, that is the 13th Doctor wearing the outfit from the power of the Doctor. And then the next figure. Now, this is one I'm really happy to say. So, this is the one I actually do want to cosplay of David Tennant the most. So, here he is. A.K.A. the 14th Doctor. Wearing his suit as we see him from the Regeneration and from the 60th anniversary set photos of him running around and even from the trailer. I absolutely think this is brilliant. I've preferred this outfit to his 10th Doctor outfit. So I'm literally just going to get a 10th Doctor figure and show you what this difference is. So come here, Mr. 10. So this is from 20. Um, this year and this is from last year's figure line as you can see yeah the head sculpts is so much better you can actually tell this is the 14th doctor much older why are you wearing my face again i don't know why are you wearing my face again like so and then of course i do prefer him wearing the blue suit with the brown suit but my favorite outfit for davidson playing getting kind of the doctor has got to be this one i have to admit i really do enjoy this one i like it i want to cosplay this suit Luckily, the tartan jacket and the tartan trousers, you know. Then, of course, you've got the tie. So much different than the 10th Doctor. And I'm probably going to place him looking like this, going... Just look like he's just regenerated and he's there confused, going, What? 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 So, um, the 14th Doctor, as you can see, this one is got the the ball points in the shoulder where the tenant one's just mainly like stiff like it was back in 2006 but this is my have to be my favorite david tenant figure i have to admit if i was going to say what's my favorite tenant figure it's definitely this one this one's took over the place of the 10th doctor in his blue suit i actually prefer this one I love the blue coat. This is the outfit I this is the outfit I really do want to cosplay for the 14th Doctor. And if I was going to call because I'm only going to cosplay one version of the Doctor. If I was going to pick a David Tennant cosplay, it'd definitely be the 14th Doctor. I do really want to cosplay him at some point, which is absolutely brilliant. So that's the 14th Doctor. Also, we have the a little bit of accessory for this one, which is as you can see, the 13th Doctor's little sonic screwdriver. So, yeah. Got the 13th Doctor sonic screwdriver. So, that is Doctor Who, the power of the Doctor. My thought, general thoughts on it, it's brilliant. I have to admit, it's brilliant. I do like the fact we got Jodie wearing the different Doctor's outfits. And, of course, we have the 10th Doctor in... Well, sorry. The 14th Doctor now, so I have a brand new tenant figure as the 14th Doctor to go next in with me Doctor's lineup. So now I've got all of the Doctors that have been released so far, apart from Joe Martin. If she ever does get a release, I really would welcome that figure line. Maybe if it came in the B&M set this year and we get a fu fugitive Doctor, I'd probably buy two of them. One to go with the Doctors and then one to go in me Joe de Whitaker shelf. So, diving into the next one. Oh, this one. This is a classic figure set. I love Classic Who. And I've been hesitating to get this over a year. I've been really, want, I've been thinking about it for over a year. You know, just to get, get into it, go and buy it. Think, you know. And I've been putting myself off. And then, as I was ordering the, the regeneration set from Power of the Doctor, I thought, right, that's it. I'm just going to get it. Just dive in, get it. Because I have seen people's reviews. And I know what this story, it is not as popular. But I really do enjoy the story for what it is. Even though it's not gr a brilliant story. It's not great. So here he is. So here is the next one. Let's take it out of the box. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant. So the next one is, of course, Warriors of the Deep. The character on an exclusive from last year. Luckily, they still had... Some it left in stock. 
Oh, brilliant. I got Silorians. Yes, and the best thing is, I will, my Peter Davison shelf looks a lot fuller now because he's only got two major villains, which is the Cybermen, and he's got an Astron robot and the Andro the Cyber Android. So I'm looking forward to adding these straight into the Peter Davison collection. So let's get this open and I can show you what I think of this set and which set I think is the best one so far for the character line exclusives because I never got the jungle uh the jungle episode of the chase Daleks really wish I got that one when I did when I had the chance but I did manage to get myself the second doctor and Tyrus a couple of years ago and as you can see here's the window box taken out so let's look at the figures themselves let's look at that oh that's brilliant we actually have a nice detailing in a backdrop from the Silurians, um underwater sea base where they team up with the ice, um, with the sea devils. Yes, as I said, this story isn't much loved by most fans, but I enjoy it because it is just a return of the sea devils and the Silurians, which were my favourite John Purple villains. But I have to be honest, Modern Who has ruined the Silurians for me. And... I'm just going to say that Modern Who did ruin the Silurians for me, where Classic Who, they were more brilliant looking. I mean, look, compare this Silurian to the modern ones that we see in the Matt Smith era. What a big, fantastic way to improve the classic line with these Silurians. Oh, dropped one. Um, so we have, I can't remember this Silurian's character name, but we do have the one that talks. So it does look like he's talking, which is the red light one. Uh, Victor, I think his name is Victor, because the doctor says, why are they talking in the same base? And he goes, you know me once as the doctor. The doctor. I have to admit, these Silurians are probably like the same figure base, but I'm not really going to moan. There we are. There we are. Oh dear. And there we are. The figures of Warriors of the Deep of the Silurians. I'm glad I've got another piece of 80, 1980 figures to join in myself with the Peter Davisons. So I'm absolutely looking forward to adding these in. Were these actually worth $29.99? Yes, because you do get free figures. I actually do think the 60th anniversary set is worth it as well. So I'm going to literally put these in where I think where to put them. And then I'm going to show you where they actually are in place after. So join me back in a couple of minutes. And welcome back. So as you can see, there is now the Boys of the Deep set slot into my Peter Davison section of the South. So now he's got the Silurians, Cybermen. So his villains are starting to build up a bit. But I'm hoping we get Resurrection of the Daleks figure set this year in B&M. So that way he can have some Daleks to join in his villainous collection side. And here is the Power of the Doctor set. As you can see, I've now put them all together with me other Doctors and Tardises. Especially when you've got Hartnell's there. With the others and then fitting in the current TARDIS box. And then of course you've got all of the Doctors with them now. And look how brilliant they look lined up with the other Doctors. And look how brilliant it is to have the 14th Doctor just to slide in with his off other incarnations. Including his 10th incarnation. Yeah. So thank you for watching this Doctor Who unboxing and review. I hope you have a cracking day. Let me know in the comments what you think of these figure sets. And please do like, subscribe, share, and enjoy some awesome Doctor Who content.